there students welcome back to my youtube channel here we are again into another video lesson obviously i am now in an outdoor setting for our video today so i have changed the setup of our video lesson today para bagay siya sa ating so ano bang lesson natin ngayon na may kaugnayan sa outdoor setting so, our video lesson today would all about the climbing. Starting this video lesson, we will now move into another chapter of our third quarter, which is about May. Now, before we start about the discussion on the climate, let us have first this question. Is there any difference between the climate and the weather? Grabe! Ang init na nga ngayon! Kapag ganitong mainit ang panahon, ang serap kumain ng ice cream, uminom ng napakalamig na tubig, at syempre kumain ng halo-halo. Ay! Teka, yun! Biglang! Ano lang? Ang ipinipinig lang, tapos biglang umuulan? So that scenario is what we call as weather. Ano ba na ba ngayon? Ha? Huh? April na? Wow! Sorry na! I'm swimming! Eventually. Ang bilis naman natapos ng summer. At least nangitim naman ako sa pagsiswimming. Naku! Papasok na ang per months. Tag-ulan na. Pero... Sigurado kapag bear months na sa ibang bansa, nag snow Sana all. Sana dito din nakakapaglaro ako ng snow. Sana dito din nararamdaman ko yung lamig. So that instance is called climate. So dun sa mga acting na ginawa ko, medyo nag-gets mo ba ang pagkakaiba ng climate sa so weather? So climate and weather are sometimes mistaken, but actually they are not the same. When we say weather, it's the day-to-day -day changes or patterns in the atmosphere at a particular time and place. It's a mix of events that happens each day. So, for example, ang init-init ngayon, pero pwedeng mamayang gabi, is uulan. So, that is weather. Yung pabago-bago ng weather sa bawat araw in a particular time and Place. So, for example, I am here in Tayabas, mainit dito ngayon, pero pwedeng umuulan sa Lukban, pwedeng umuulan sa Lucena, or in other places. So, meaning to say, that is what we call as weather. So, if that is what we meant by the word weather, what does a climate mean? When we say climate, it's the cumulative pattern of weather over a long period of time. The average weather in a place over many years and it takes millions of years to change the climate of a particular place. We have five main types of climate that is found on Earth and that is called climate zones. So the five climate zones that are found on Earth are the tropical, the dry, the temperate, the continental, and the polar. This climate zones defines what will be the climate of a particular place in those areas. And these are the designations of the climate zones on Earth. In the tropical area, in the earth those are the areas that experiences a climate of hot and humid all year round mean to say ang mga bansa na matatagpuan mo dito sa tropical zone 
ay nakakaranas ng mainit na klima sa buong taon. For the dry climate zones on the North Hemisphere and South Hemisphere, they are called dry climate zones because the moisture in these areas rapidly evaporated. That's why they are called dry. In the temperate climate zones, it is typically warm and humid during summers, but during winters, they experience thunderstorms and mild cold winters. Next on climate zone is the continental. Medyo pataas na tayo, no? Earth at pababa naman in the South Hemisphere. In these areas, they are experiencing warm to cool summers and very cold winters. Medyo lumalamig na ang klima in the continental area. And in the last climate zone called polar, in these areas, they are experiencing a climate of extremely cold even during summers. Those are the five climate zones that we may found on Earth which clearly defines the climate of a particular place. Now, question to which climate zone is Philippines belong? Our country Philippines belong to tropical climate zones. That is why we are experiencing a very hot and humid climate. Just like Why do you think so we have this tropical climate zones? We have cold winters. Can't we have snowfall? Bakit nga ba? Ba't nga ba mainit dito sa Pilipinas? So for our next video lesson, what we will talk about is the factor affecting the climate of an area. Ano ba yung factors kung bakit dito sa Pilipinas yung mainit while on the other countries, hindi naman. Stay tuned for our next video lesson. I'll see you again. Bye!